What's going on, people? So it's very early in the morning. The Lord put this word on my heart, and I know this is for somebody. So whoever you are, I hope you do receive it. Um, he took me to Jeremiah 2.3, uh, which says something along the lines of, don't quote me word for word, but just off the top of my head, um, Israel was set apart to the Lord. They were like fresh fruit of a harvest to him. And those that tried to devour them were punished and disaster came upon them, says the Lord. So I believe that's correct. You can go ahead and check Jeremiah 2, 3. But as he put this on my heart, I wanted to share it because whoever you are, it's okay to move forward. Pray about it, ask God for confirmation, but move forward against the opposition that you're facing right now. Because at this moment, it doesn't matter. Just like Israel, he set you apart. And as he sets you apart, that comes with him making sure that whatever is going to be opposing you, whatever is being set against you, whoever is creating obstacles in your path is going to be devoured. They're trying to devour you, but the Lord's going to ensure that they're devoured. That because they're coming against you, which the Lord is looking after, which the Lord set apart, that means you're special. He set you apart. He's going to make sure that they are punished. He is going to make sure that great disaster comes upon them. However, he wants to dish that out to them. That's not up to you. What's up to you is to move forward. Take the next steps. It's okay to go forward and trust in the Lord about it because he's going to take care of the opposition. Don't let nothing hold you back. And again, continuously pray to God in Jesus' name. Seek that confirmation, but move forward. The opposition won't stand. It will fall. It will be devoured. Great disaster will come upon them. How the Lord chooses and sees fit, but you are safe. Move forward, make that decision. Don't let nothing hold you back because God is with you. Be blessed, guys.